The violence on our own streets was the focus of a rally this evening. Specifically, those who gathered are asking why there still hasn't been an arrest in the murder of a little girl. CBS 4's Tiani Jones is live at Miami-Dade Police Headquarters with this story. Tiani. Well, tonight we saw mothers unite, all of them having one thing in common. They've lost children to gun violence, and tonight they said they want it to stop. Sunday will make a whole month since my baby was shot. Mother, the pain is unbearable. This is the worst pain you could ever bear. After mother, my heart is aching. I can barely stand. After mother, they embrace each other with a knowing, a knowing of the pain each other feels. They bury children who died from gun violence. No justice, no sleep. Thursday evening, the women united at a march and rally for eight year old Jada Page, shot and killed almost a month ago. Her killer still out there. My baby was only eight years old, and she deserves justice. And as hard as it is to keep doing this, I said, I won't stop until we find out who did this to my baby. Their rally cry was for help and a warning that as long as the killer remains free, no child is safe. This is the fifth week of school, and for those parents, today is progress report day. Jada should have been getting in the car with her mom in excitement to show her her progress report. The dozens who came out are vowing to continue to rally and march until an arrest is made. The violence stops, and mothers no longer have to bury babies. Somebody in this neighborhood knows something. And I know somebody in this neighborhood knows something. It's time for our community, families and friends to get on Facebook and come and help. We will not disappear. We will not go away. We will not give up. We will not get tired. We will not let it go. We will not move on with our lives. We will not give it a rest. We will not, we will not, we will not, we will not. Jada's friends and family say they continue to rally and march because they want someone to come forward and put her killer or killers in jail. Reporting live from the Miami-Dade Police Department, Tiani Jones, CBS 4 News Tonight. Powerful message, Tiani. Thank you.